A Toledo man is facing his third fight with a terminal illness, but this time he says he's viewing it as a positive adventure. Fox Toledo's Christy Lee is live now with what he's using to get through this battle. Well, after becoming unemployed again for the second time in just two years, Scott Lightfoot found out his cancer had returned. His doctors say he has a 30% chance of making it to five years. But instead of dwelling on the bad news, Lightfoot is concentrating on his passion for art to get him through. Uh, I'm not counting down to the last days. I'm counting up to getting past it and moving on. He calls it the 1825 plan, the number of days there are in five years. My goal is to do a drawing uh, every day or work on progress on a piece of artwork every day and then share that online all the way up through 1825 days and longer. Uh, when I get to that point. With the extra time he has in recovery, Scott Lightfoot has converted half of his garage into an art studio. He and his assistant, Georgia, spend a little time in there each day. It allows me to get my feelings on canvas. Um, feelings of anger, feelings of hope, feelings of despair can all come through color. They can come through uh, the, the subject matter of the picture. And sometimes the subject is the cancer itself. He combines magnified images of the disease with drawings of the chemical compounds of the drugs or the chemo to show them fighting off the illness. It makes it a lot more real for me and it allows me to connect and realize that the medicine is doing what it's supposed to do. Lightfoot has also been working on a cancer themed comic book called Chemo Radiation Man. You can find an ebook version of that graphic novel on Amazon.com. We'll have a link to that as well as a link to Lightfoot's blog, Survival Through Art, on our webpage, foxtoledo.com. Reporting live tonight, Christy Lee, Fox Toledo News.